So I wanted to go kick some ass in 2k today and then I realized where in tarnation is my roster Which is why in today's video we're gonna be using NBA basketball cards to build our team Now the way this works is fairly simple man has pack man opens pack in pack is player player goes on roster We build team we go online and we kick some you know what get it got it good we got four boxes, each one has three packs in them. That's gonna be a grand total of 12. And to make things even tougher, each pack only has four cards. All the players that I pull in today's pack opening, I'm gonna be giving away. I don't care if it's an autographed Scotty Barnes. Y'all just let me know in the comments which cards you really want. And if they're nice enough, I'm gonna send them out to you guys. With that being Yay. said though, let's get it started. I can't lie, I'm pretty nervous because when it comes to four cards, I haven't done this in a while, but our first player of this pack is going to be Victor Oladipo. I think he's got a dark matter, but that's not really gonna be a good start for us. Number two is gonna be Ty Ty Washington Jr. That is a rookie card. So if you're a Rockets fan, let me know in the comments. Card number three is Wendell Moore Jr. Does he even have a My Team card? Serious question. And then last but not least, it's going to be Donovan Mitchell, who honestly, I think is probably gonna be the easy choice out of these four. Definitely undersized at this point in the year, but hey, if he can get buckets, we ball. Donovan, welcome to the team, man. Definitely not a bad start, but definitely not ideal either to kickstart this next pack. Oh, Franz Wagner. Unfortunately, I don't think I have that Dark Matter or Galaxy Opal, the one that was a reward card. I'll have to double check. Either way, let's keep it moving. Right after that, it's gonna be Doug McDermott. Oh my goodness, I might've gotten scammed with these packs. These weren't cheap packs either. It's my first time opening these. Is that who I think it is? It's gonna be the man who's got the problem with the hose, what? Zion Williamson. Most people thought Mo Bamba had the hose calling. Nah, it's this man. Literally, she won't stop calling, it's crazy. And then to finish off the box, we've got, oh, Evan Mobley. Hey, listen, man, I'm gonna let Zion deal with his diet and his woman issues. I need someone that's here to ball. And invincible Evan Mobley is here to ball. The one thing that sucks about these pack openings is I know I'm not guaranteed a Yao Ming. I don't think we've ever pulled an IRL Yao Ming card, but to start this next one, Oh, John, I thought that was J.R. Smith. It looked like him for a second, but John Wall, definitely not a bad choice. I would like a taller point guard, but we can make that work. Next up is gonna be Herbert Jones, who I believe has a Galaxy Opal, maybe a Dark Matter. I know he's got a pink diamond, but uh, right now it's looking like it's gonna be John Wall. Next pack after that is, oh! A silver Jalen Green. And last but not least, it's going to be, what? Who the f... Georges Niang? <laughs> Georges... What the heck? Listen, man, all love to Jalen Green. He's a stud, but not only is John Wall one of my favorite point guards of all time, his card is also just better when it comes to my team. Give Jalen an invincible, though, and we'll talk. I can't lie to you, box number one definitely kind of sucked, but let's see if box number two can be better, and uh... <laughs> oh my gosh. We're starting with Alec Burks. I don't even want to tell you guys how much I spent on these packs. This is low-key kind of embarrassing. Y'all can take all these cards. Draymond Green, definitely not a bad option, but we've got so many people that play point guard already, and he's kind of small for a three. Right after that, yeah. we've got <laughs> Patrick Beverly. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. And then lastly, we've got... Oh, this guy might be our savior, Brandon Ingram. Definitely doesn't have the best My Team cards this year, but what the hell was I looking at? On the bright side, Brandon Ingram is a dark matter. On the downside, we're gonna need a lot more if we're gonna fight those end games out there. All right, next pack, baby, let's get right to it. Please start me off hot. That's what I'm talking about! Joel Embiid, he's likely gonna end up being the player we pick out of here. I mean, come on, that's gonna be likely our first end game of the day right after Wardell Stephen Curry. Y'all couldn't balance these out in different packs? I've already low-key got my point guards, unfortunately, so Embiid, you're looking like number one right now. <gasps> Is this the autograph? Oh my gosh. Is this an... Y'all can see it, Tari Eason. 
Is it an autograph? LOL. No, it is not. It is just an immersion. So that's regular. And then last but not least, we got a Shade and Sharp rookie card. I know you get trolled for never making it past the second round, but listen, you don't gotta do all that. Just help me win a game of Unlimited. All right, man, last pack of the box. Can we please get some more magic like that? Ooh, Gary Trent Jr., that's my boy. Unfortunately, my team, y'all don't be showing him love like that. Right after, we got ourselves a Monte Morris. So we're right back to the mid after a hot pack like that. Yes! I can tell who that is. The Greek freak. Giannis Antetokounmpo, I don't think there's anybody topping that, but we can try. And it is actually going to be a Benedict Matherin rookie card. So there's only three Giannis's in the auction house. And I'm already getting outbid like crazy. If we uh, don't win this, we can just use the Invincible. Box number two was by far the best one. Gave us two end games, But to start, box number three is that Jalen Suggs. Yes, it is. I think he's going to be solid, but... Just not meant for my team. That looks like it's going to be Nikola Jovic. Not Jokic, Jovic. It is a rookie card though, so that's still pretty mint. I'll get that out of here nice and slow. And then we've got, ooh, Team USA, Kevin Durant. Ooh, and it's shiny. And then last but not least, we've got New York, New York. Jalen Brunson, but I can't lie to you, my decision is looking pretty easy here too. Thankfully, we don't gotta worry about buying him because he's in the collection. End game, Kevin Durant. See, now the team's starting to get crazy. Let's keep it moving, man, let's keep it moving. So to start this one, it's gonna be PJ Washington. Shout out to him with Brittany Renner. Up next, we've got Dominique Wilkins. That's the first historic player we've gotten today, I'm pretty sure. That's pretty fire, actually. Yo, good, good job, good job. Right after that, we've got <laughs> Clint Capella. All right, all right, yeah. And then after that, we got um Jaden McDaniels. So uh, yeah, once again, surrounded by mid, but there was a gem in there. The human highlight reel in invincible fashion. Dominique Wilkins, welcome to the team, baby. If this last pack can get me an endgame or invincible, it's gonna by far be the best one. And to start, is that Wardell again? Oh, that's Jordan Poole. Oops. I'm sorry, Jordan. You're not a warrior anymore. But uh, right after that, we've got Bryce McGowan's rookie card. I honestly don't really know who he is, but if you like him, let me know. And right after that is going to be another Tari Eason. The exact same card. And then to finish it off, Buddy Healed. Oh my gosh. Who, who do I even choose? <laughs> I mean, I guess we might have to open extra packs if we can't get ourselves a center or power forward though. All right, box number four. All I need is some decent bigs and you're gonna start me off with Frank Jackson. I thought it was Killian Hayes. I have not heard of that man in a good minute. Right after, Onyeka Okongwu. But, oh, I mean, it is a big man. I thought that was DeMarcus Cousins for a second. We got a nice little green version of Amari Stoudemire. So next one. And that looks like it's going to be a Jovic rookie card once again. Not exactly the big man we wanted, but it's the big man we'll take. Pause. Now that I know historic players are in here, please just throw me a D-Rob or a Yao Ming. But that's Kobe White to start. That's going to be our boy Bubble Butt Lowry. Come on, where's the big man? <laughs> Get it? Because it's a joke. Huh? I'm laughing. It's the Joker. Nikola Jokic. NBA champion, horse racing champion recently, which it looks like he's actually enjoyed a bit more than his NBA championship. But ooh, in that silver color too, if y'all want this NBA champion, let me know in the comments. Last card shouldn't really matter unless it's Bryce McGowan's. We're good. The best big man in the NBA right now. Honestly, you can say he's the best player in the NBA right now. Nikola Jokic, horse racing champion. I need y'all to lock in with me. This is our final pack. And to start, <laughs> I wish he had an end game card. His invincible is nothing crazy, but a big man's a big man. I like the sign of that. Right after we got ourselves a Jalen Duran rookie card. I think he's going to end up being such a good player. 
And then right after, we've got DeMar DeRozan. Definitely not too shabby. And to finish off our pack opening, three, two, one, boom! Who is that? It's out of focus. Oh! <laughs> The piston I'm definitely looking for, Cade Cunningham. I am so high on this player. Like so many people don't realize how good Cade is gonna be, but he was just injured. This man's potential is arguably best player in the NBA. Come back to this video the day that possibly happens. Hey, hey, I'm happy. And the best part is this card is insane. One of the better cards in the game that is not an end game. I'm happy, man. Thank God nobody was bidding crazy because that's the final piece. We got him. Now, ladies and gentlemen, when it's all said and done, put it together and you got boom. A unit that actually turned out a lot better than I thought it would, especially to start the video when we had the Donovan Mitchell and the Brandon Ingram. I was low key feeling hopeless. Honestly, this starting five is looking like it's gonna be enough to hold it down. If Ingram can get me a bucket or two, we're definitely gonna be vibing. But uh, this costs not only quite a bit of money, but also a lot of MT for that Giannis. So hopefully we can go out there and hoop. With that being said, it's time to get busy. All right, what are we working with, man? Jokic at point guard, Michael Jordan, Larry Bird, Porzingis, Endgame, and Mark Eaton. No sign of Wembenyama or a full lineup of Endgames. I low-key got a chance. Go for that corner, I'm there. Oh, let's go, baby. Now let's run. Look at Giannis going for a mild jog. Catch and shoot, I paid so much MT for you. You better knock down your threes. Let's get it started, baby. Yo, can we space the floor a little better? I called for a screen and MB didn't even know where to go. Got him. Sim Nation, hold that. Sim Nation, hold that. <laughs> We've got cards that can do everything and your only offense is post offense. Like you just have no bag. MB, catch and shoot. See, that's how you shoot a three, by the way. Boom. Come on, Giannis, I need a nice little screen from you. Bro, what is this spacing? Kate, what are you doing there? Pump fake, are they jumping? No, they're not easy mash for Giannis. And that's a bucket, give me that. Ooh, give me that. That's a steal, come on, Evan, Evan, get the ball. There's no way we don't get that, thank you. Oh my goodness, this game sometimes. Definitely not our strongest first quarter, but that's all good, because we're gonna ball in the second. Ingram gets himself a bucket as well. It's only a four point game. We're warming up. Good defense, good defense there, Embiid. Hold it down, someone get that rebound. Giannis, we out. Push him out the way, got the corner. Wilkins, that's only a mid-range, but Evan, man. It's a bucket, we'll take it. Got him, thank you. Oh, it's too much space for Cade. I'm not sure what you're doing there, Lamelo, but you better play some defense. Give me all three of those. Give me that. Good defense, Embiid. Oh, yeah. You might be defensive player of the year. I wanted to go an alley -oop so bad, but Giannis stopped running. We on that. We on that. Good D. Good D. Hands up. Hands up. Oh, I'm getting mashed, aren't I? No, I'm not. Come on, baby. Where's Giannis? I paid too much MT for that man to stay stable. Bro, what are all those extra? See, I didn't even do any of that. Kate just wanted to do all of that. We got takeover though. Let's keep hooping. We got Giannis and takeover. I'm a YOLO it. I'm a YOLO it. Bam! You better not give that man space. Shirley Stoudemire is catching oops, right? There we go. Nice little pick and roll offense though. Slowest dunk animation of all time. Let's get back. Yes, sir. Johnny. Pump fake. Easy blow by John Wall. Hey! Welcome to the team. I need the human highlight reel to give me a highlight reel. Hey, we draw the foul and we got some free throws, but man, when you don't play my team for a while, the game feels so different. And I don't mean that in a good way. Like you start to realize compared to other online games, how bad the delay and the movements can be in a video game. I need 2K24 to hoop for me, man. Give me an ISO here, man. I'm cooking this Tim Duncan. Has he? Drive? Big Walk fell. back, yep, that's a three. Down, Johnny. <laughs> He's got the bender, switch that. He's gonna throw the pass. He goes for the leaner instead, and we got that board for sure. Let's get the second half going. Oh, Stoudemire, he's going for it. Never mind. out to Giannis. Pump fake, they're not jumping at it. I'm going baseline. Hey! We're there, we're there, we're there. Good defense, good defense. Stoudemire is actually not doing the worst. If I get mashed here, it's GG though. Just hands up, oh my gosh. MVP Jokic. Doing MVP things, that's too much space there for the MVP. You can't off ball these end games. I just can't shoot. I'm getting a three out of this. He is not respecting me. Thank you, stopping. Cade, that's a moving three. 
Oh my goodness. Oh my damn. I love invincible jumpers more than end games. I really can't time these end game cards. Good shot. That's a beautiful shot. Can someone please let me know what we're doing from a spacing standpoint? Thank you. Hit that screen. Got Stoudemire. First time using a jumper ever. And y'all still disrespect him and give him that space? Giannis has been hooping for us tonight, but man, the way the game plays is horrible. I am not enjoying 2K23 gameplay at all. Oh yeah, John Wall, got the corner. Embiid, those jumpers are so hard to time on these end games, bro. I suck. Don't let him shoot that. Get there, Embiid! Ah, good defense! Oh, we gotta get boards on a defensive stop like that. Good D, good D, good D. There's no way he just made that pass. There's just no way he's making that pass. Thank you. Get a rebound in this game. Give me that to steal. Get the, thank you, Mike. This game is pissing me off. KD, that's not KD. No, I mean, I guess I'll take the two. I guess, oh, I passed it to the wrong icon. That's on me. Give me that. Good D, good D, good D, good D. Oh, that's got a, yo, he's got algo. I'm not gonna lie. He has algo so bad right now. Look at this. This is what we call spacing, right? This is what we call spacing. Cross it up, thank you. Bye-bye, Tim. Bye-bye, Tim, you just got cooked. Easy dunk. What? Why did he just... It was a two-point game. I think he might have lagged out. You can see it lagging at the bottom of the screen. You see the substitutions? It's all messed. I think he might have lagged out. Not exactly how I wanted to win that game, but I guess we'll take it. Playing 2K23 can be so frustrating. I also just suck because I can't green with any of these end games, which makes it tougher, but we still came out on top and that's what matters. How should I build my team next? Y'all let me know in the comments. Until then, make sure you guys go ahead and check these videos out. And until our next banger, take care. Woo!